Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Force of Nature 2, Ghost Keepers on the Radio Man 03. Awesome to have you along. Did some reorganizing. Mm -hmm. A little bit of reorganizing. We got kind of a little kitchen area going on over here with our charcoal. Got the workbenches we've got so far set up here with resources in them. Here's our uh, tannery. I put the tannery up so we can get started on that. I have made a few leather. They're in my inventory. We've got our traps today. We have to capture an animal. That's the next objective for us. I just got done growing a bunch more flax, so of course I can make more rope. I tell you what, man, I've got, or linen, I should say, I've got a ton of these linen seeds, just tons of them. So many of them. This is working out pretty good, this uh, six plot. I could pretty much stand in the middle here and grab all of it without having to any really move much at all. And then I can replant from the middle too. So I don't think I'm ever going to go bigger than these six grow plots. And then we'll do six different ones. And, you know, we'll have a, a decent uh, a decent farm area. Really what I found is what I need, I just grow a bunch of since it grows relatively quickly. And I seem to be fine with that. Let's go ahead and plant a little bit of it. I'm going to actually start throwing this stuff in there. So we've got it handy. And then, did I grab that bowl? I did. Good. Let's grab some water. We've got the traps in our inventory. We can get one animal right now with the barn. I think what I would like to do is get another building put up. But even before I even think about doing that, I would like to go out and do some hunting and get some more pelts together so that we can get some armor put together. I want the tailor bench right now. That's our next objective after we plant our plants today. Uh, and get the tailor bench put down so we can start making armor which is going to require us to go out and do a little exploring and a little bit of hunting as well, which I think is a good idea. Uh, inventory. And we can gather resources while we're out and about doing that. All right, let's do another round of the linen. So if I stand here, I could pretty much go P, P, P. I think I'm going to run out of water, though. Yep, there it is. I'm out of water. I've got to go. Oh. oh, I used it all up. Dang it, Jim. I did. I used it all up. Let's do that one more time. Uh, so what I did was I kind of um, extended us a little bit. Oh, I need to select six. There we go. I extended our property line a bit. I'll show you here in just a second. Oh, boy. Not only is it nighttime, but it's pouring down rain on us. Horrible. Oh, it'd be so freezing. Yeah, we need to get some decent armor on so then we can go really do some decent exploring and, you know find some stuff. Uh, I'm going to do that one more time. Just double it up, because I keep running out. I'm one short every time, it seems like. I'm enjoying it so far. I think it's... I, I enjoy all the different workstations and just the progress of the game and what you have to do to, you know, make that next step. I like that. And it's all laid out pretty clearly for us. Once we catch a, Once we catch an animal, of course, this objective will probably light up again. Oops, sorry. And, uh... Tell us what it wants to do next, you know? I mean, this crop's already at 42% right there, you know? It's pretty cool. So, let's go ahead and put this in here. I've got 36 water, so I'll be able to plant again. We're going to put you in there, too. And there's some seeds. Look at that. I mean, there's so many of them. What do I do with all of them? I guess I'll feed them to the animals? Is that what I do? I don't know if they eat the linen seeds. I think they like the wheat ones. Uh, wow, it's nasty out, but let's go ahead and build our tailor bench. The tailor table is... I, I need it. We, we need to get our, um, our clothing put together, our armor. Oh, which, by the way, this would probably be a good spot for it right here. There's a mannequin on the front of it, it looks like. Hmm. I'm going to guess that it goes that away. We'll put it over here by the uh, tannery. That way we, uh, you know... They kind of go hand in hand, correct? Correct. We got a basket here too. I've got logs in there right now, but I figured we put the uh, uh, the the pelts and, and leather and stuff like that in here. We need this bench because there's one key. At, well, first of all, it's what we use to make the armor. So there's that. Look at the crops behind us are almost grown already. I also have a little farm area just up uh, above us here. I'll take you up there and see. You can see on the map here. I've changed kind of our entrances. We now have three different locations, which isn't ideal, but that's what I've had to do to kind of secure us into this area. I'll show you what I did here. All right, let's take a look in here. We'll get maybe something going. Uh, we don't have any. What's wood button? Uh, I've got uh, seven sticks on me. Oh, I need a knife in here. That's what it is. 
Uh, ooh, where do we have a knife? I th think I've got the knife. Well, I don't know actually where I have it. Here it is. Okay. Let's put a knife in here. Uh, there you are. Gotcha. Okay, wood buttons. Let's go ahead and do 12 of them. We're going to need the wood buttons for the clothing. We've got the light skin coat, skin sandals, skin coat, skin hood, a sleeping bag, skin pants, bam braces, light skin pants, and skin boots. I'm going to go with the skin coat first. I've got the rope on me, as well as the leather, so I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, I need the buttons. There we go. Let's make that skin coat. That's going to be our basically our chest plate, right? Oh, looks like that's using the nine buttons, huh? That's all right. Let's do it. Let's get that built. I'm going to see how much of this I can make right now. And we'll look at the farm area. But this is going to be key to us uh, getting out there and getting some stuff. Oh, let's queue that up next. Give me a basket. Uh, now we're going to be out of rope. The basket we can actually put up here in our inventory slot, and it's going to... Uh, give us an extra, I believe, an extra row of inventory space down here. Which is super handy since now we're ready to kind of step out the door and do some exploration. We've got a, I think we're, we've got a pretty good campsite established at the moment. I'm new to all of this, so, you know. Let's, uh, let's just go ahead and do the rest of those. We're going to need them anyways, so let's make them. I don't think I can do this and work on the tannery at the same time. <laughs> it's one or the other. This is where the first ghost is going to come in handy because they're going to be doing some of this work for us once we get them. Here comes the buttons. Uh, let's take that and put that right there. Boom, look at that. I guess it's not a whole row, huh? But it's more space for dang sure. And there's our coat I think what we could do is maybe go to number two and put that on there and we'll wear the number two slot for the uh, armor that we're making right now we've got some more buttons here can I make anything else do I have any more pelts I've got two pelts left uh, it's not gonna be enough to really do anything with right now so yeah what I'm gonna have to do is Actually, go back to number one. We'll take this and put this on. Take that off and we'll put this and stow it away. At least I got the jeans and the shoes. And we've got the extra inventory space, so that's pretty nice. Let's go ahead and put the buttons in here. And I believe I was keeping the rope... Uh, no, in here. There we go. We'll put the rope in here. I need stones or something for this. I, I don't know what I need and I didn't want to take the time to, to figure it out. So I've just been kind of... Going with the spear at the moment. Got five logs. And a couple of hides. Oh man, where am I going to put my hide? We're going to throw the hide in here for now. Yeah, let's do that for now. And then let's also... I've got a little bit, maybe some space in here. I have no space in here. Yeah, look at all the stuff. i got to sit down and just let them do a bunch of rope again. I've got plenty of linen uh, here. I just need some space to, to store stuff. We need to get the metallurgy on, that way we get a better chest, too, down the road, which would be nice. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can... Is this the same stuff? It is. Let's go ahead and store that right there. I know. It's the, it's the best place in the world for it. I'm also going to drop that in there. I've got 50 potatoes on me. I don't need all those potatoes, but I guess we'll take them with us. Okay. All right, we do need to do a little bit of hunting. We need more hide, so let's do that. Uh, up here, let's show me, let me show you this real quick. First of all, I chopped out all the plants and stuff that was in between these two posts right here. All this has been cleared out. There were some trees and um, sticks and stuff, and I used all that to build the fencing, which is not quite complete yet. Let me scroll back so you guys can see better. We have an exit over here now that goes, there's a boulder here. We'll go out that way. Uh, we've got an entrance way for us to load animals in this way, so they just have to come through here, and then in they go, and they follow us. And we've got a gate here, too. And eventually, this is going to meet up with this down here, and then this gate takes us out onto this beach. There is a nice Guernsey cow on this beach right up here. Do you see her? Is she pretty? We're going we're gonna to try to capture her. Uh, I think maybe I might even try to do her first, and then we get the stuff together for the goose uh, 
the goose habitat and then go get the goose second because the goose i think is a little bit ways away from here but that cow is like right there and i think there's a chicken down there too anyways i want to fence this off over to here too as well uh, this is kind of uh barricaded naturally i don't think anything t you know right here is kind of a questionable area but for the most part nothing can get through this way so i figure if i run the fence over to here i can use this area back here later on down the road for uh, more farm space or something for the animals we could do something like that all right and then i've got the exit out here we had the other exit which you already saw earlier uh, on the other side of the farm there we go and then this kind of pops us out right here which is really nice i like that exit so let's see if we can find some stuff to kill and we'll just grab up everything while we're doing it because it's the right thing to do Oh, there we go. Nice. Get the piggy. That's it. Beat him down. See, the armor's going to help us considerably. Considerably. Just that little bit of armor. Nope. Don't, don't, don't poke that anymore. Oh, there's a goose right there. A black goose. Ooh, really? There's a, there's a lamb? Uh oh. I've got the traps on me, so if we get a chance, we might grab that goose right there. Oh, there's a lamb right there, too. Uh, we don't need wool just yet. What we need is feathers for a bow and arrow, which would be nice. Where did it go? Where did, which way did it walk off to? Him? There we go. I hear you. I hear you. Okay, there you are. I see you. Number four. Let's try it. Gotcha. Follow me. Gotcha. I wanted a goose to begin with. We got one. Come on, sweetheart. Oh, look at her. She's a pretty one. Oh, I like her a lot. She's really beautiful. That's a pretty bird. Yeah, pretty bird. <laughs> uh, I'm missing my spot. We're on the other side of this fence. I've not really come out this way in a while. Not since I put this in. I'm just going to look for the boulders. There they are. Scroll back a little bit. Sorry, guys. Come here, sweetheart. I'm going to put you in here. Not that you can, you're can contained or anything, but, you know, whatever. You're in here. And then we're going to click on you again and tell you to wait right here. You just stay there and be beautiful. And if I feed her, she will give me feathers. I don't believe I necessarily have to constantly feed her. But if I want something from her, I need to feed her. And she gives me feathers. Oh, man, she's gorgeous. Look at her, man. Oh, what do we name her? She is sweet looking. She is a sweet looking goose. Oh, man. So the feed options, here's your food. Some seeds and some pure water. And then within, I think it's a minute, three minutes, she'll give you three feathers. She's gorgeous. I love her. All right. I love her to death. She's awesome. Beautiful. Now, that's the only animal we can have here because that barn only holds one animal. So, we're not getting animals or trapping animals anymore today. Uh, at least not at this moment because we're going to need another structure. But I need to be able to come out here and do harvesting of sticks and stuff because we don't have it in, in our place. Oh, you know what else I found out? Um... If I, how can I just get a bare hand? If I come up here and I hit this tree, look at the apples fall. This is the only way I know of right now to get apples so that we can make that Moore's jam that I've got down there. But if I hit this tree, my stamina barely has any, any tits at all. Let's see. And I picked up six apples. D am I going to be able to grow apple trees down the road? Because right now we have this beautiful little orchard right out here. There's another one. Beautiful. Thank you. There's an orchard here. We got a second one, a third one, a fourth one. There's another one over here. There's plenty of apples here, which is really fantastic. I don't need potatoes. I don't know why I took that. Kill it. Get that fox. Oh, nice. Shooting Tex. Whoa. Oh, there's another pretty goose back here. 
Oh, I love the geese. When I was a kid, we had a farm. And we always had six geese. And, oh, my t I tell you, man. Oh, this is stick heaven. We would get six of them. And they would be out in the barnyard between the house and where the barn sat. And it was, this was called a hobby farm. It was like three and a half acres. But they would be, they would mingle around the middle of the yard there. We would leave the grass a little bit uncut there because, you know, they would take care of that. Plus, we had, we usually had a hunt, like a hundred chickens as well. So they would be out there as well. And then there was the pasture and the barnyard area. You know, they'd spread out a little bit. But you'd be sure to see the geese lots of the time there. And if you got too close to them, all six of them would come right at you. And man, they make so much noise. I can understand why they were watchdogs at one time and probably still are in some places, right? The goose, it, it, it is a watchdog. If there's something going on, they're going to let you know it's going on. You can hear them a mile away. But anyways, that's my goose story. <laughs> and then we would eat those geese for Christmas and Thanksgiving. <laughs> we never named our animals. Not, not the food ones. Uh, we did have a we had a rooster we named. We did have a rooster, the gooch. Come on, where's where's the where's the wildlife to hunt? Moo! There's another there's another there's another goose over here. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna keep walking this way. It, obviously, it keeps going. Watch out, little goose. Is that it? That's that's kind of the end of the line right there, huh? Can I get through here? I can't get through here. That's that's just seems so weird to me. But that's 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 how that's how it goes, right? Have I gotten to the edge of this? It's almost like working a puzzle up on the map there, huh? Almost. Like we're walking some kind of a puzzle. Oh, look at this. Oh, you're a beautiful cow. Now, if I try to tame these animals when I don't have space for them, it won't let me do it. Oh, we had a cow and a thing. A sheep right here. Okay, so I need to go the other way, obviously, right? <laughs> I mean, that is painfully obvious. Did we pick up anything out there? Two hide, huh? And a claw. I'm still looking to get that amulet, because I think it's going to be helpful to us. I need a few more bonfires set up, just so we have a little more light. I thought there was some kind of a decor. Um, a decor-type lantern that we could do construction decorations the only torch I see is this one here it calls for sulfur and nails and we're not there yet not until we get to the metallurgy are we gonna be there um, chair bench brazier I don't see like an inexpensive lantern that I can make there's a garden gnome <laughs> all right all right it's crazy stuff. Mannequin to put our armor on that we're not wearing. We could put it on a mannequin. That's pretty cool. Scarecrows. Okay, yeah, I don't know where they are in terms of that. I would love to be able to have a few lanterns set up, though. That would be so... Here's a fertilizer storage. But again, nails. So we need to get exploring and go the other direction. And we have to discover a, a secret something or other. I can't remember what it was called now. That's <laughs> so helpful, right? Uh, but we got to find it. It, that's how important it is. Um, where did I put those hides? Yeah, now I don't know where anything is. I don't have enough storage. we got to get to the nails. It's very important to us to get to the nails. But before we do that, I want to get to the armor. Ah, there they are. There they are. Okay, so what, what else can I make? Can I make the pants, maybe? That would be nice. Uh, what do I need for the light skin pants? I need three leather. Uh oh, and one pelt. Okay, so we could do that. We can make the pants. Three leather. Three leather. All right, there we go. And I'm going to need the buttons too. Quite sure of that. Picked up 50 plus sticks out there. That's pretty nice. Oh, and seven rope. Oh, that's right. Seven rope. Okay. Okay, I got 17. That's a good thing. Look at this. I, I didn't realize I didn't have to be here to do this. It's doing it on its own. I guess it's tanning, right? It's it's just being stretched. Oh, I didn't know that. I, I don't like to do all of it because I do need pelt still when you're making this armor. At least I think you do all the time. What does the other stuff take? There's like a, a, a light version of it that gives you some stamina as well. 
Like, that's just health. I go for the health stuff. Like, a skin coat, that's all health. But if I do the light skin coat, it also gives you plus six stamina. Hmm. That's interesting. Because you're moving faster. But armor is less. No, it's not. It's the same. So then why not go this way? Oh. Well, that seems weird to me. Plus ten maximum health. Armor four. Armor four. I guess you're, you're, you're actually still getting more. You're getting a plus one in stamina. You only get half the health, but, hmm. I don't know. I guess it's up to a preference, right? It's up to your preference. Let's see. Let's grab that stuff. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, white skin pants. There we go. That's what I'm making right there. Point. All right, beautiful. We're going to have our armored pants. And then what we'll do when the sun comes up is I want to head off in the other direction and see about the... Um, uh, what do you call it? Just a, just another place to explore and see what we can find to the right of us. It seems like we're kind of at the end of this side of it, maybe. But maybe for play's sake, what we do is put another bonfire, say, right here. Light this up a little bit here so we can see. And maybe I can do a second one over by the tannery area and that would help out over there as well. And then we'll use these as kind of our torches in the meantime until I figure it out. And then we'll just remove them and do something different here. But at least we'll have a little more light in camp while we're walking around. I think that's going to be good. Yeah, see, that's going to help a little bit. You know? Just right here. Just a little bit of something extra. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. I'm uh, working on some rope. Uh, I made 25. There's 31 in there. That's not really much of anything. I'm going to put those guys in there, too. And I'm probably going to drop those sticks in there, too, so that we have um, a little bit here. And then I'm just kind of waiting for the sun to come up, and then we'll get started and, and move out. I should grab up while I'm sitting here waiting without using too much of my stamina. Is maybe just uh, another shot of water and get, uh, you know, get maybe some wheat going. Because we're going to need that once we get the animals in here. So maybe I should do that. So I was just thinking to myself, in this pouring rain, <laughs> that maybe it would be good to build the goosery, and then the goose would have a place to live, and then I could go grab that Guernsey cow, and we'd have that going for us too. Can I move... Let's actually move this over to here. Let me put you right back up here. There we go. Um, I need five sticks, so I'm going to need some sticks. I'm going to need some rope. Okay. I didn't know this, but if you walk away from the basket, it eventually just closes. Huh. I didn't know that. We got five of those, and then wheat, grain, and... Oh, you know what? Clay. Duh. Gotta get some clay. Oh my gosh. Just exactly what I need. Huh. Look at that. An empty storage space. That should be filled up with clay again. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, we have tons of linen. Well, not tons of it, but there we go. So, let's go ahead and do the barn. Or the goosery, I mean. And then the goose can be in the goosery, and then we can have a different... Can get a second animal, because that'll hold one animal right there. I don't know why I closed that. I don't even know where she is. Sweetheart, where are you? Where is the goose? Did she walk out of here? No, she wouldn't walk out of here, right? I said, wait here. <laughs> what the heck? Maybe I shouldn't put anything else in here. Where is she? I don't know. I'm going to build this anyways. Oh, goosery. Yeah, let's set it right back there. Uh, I can go back to the fence almost with it. Let's go ahead and do that right there. That's going to be cute right there. There we go. Let's build us a goosery for the goose we don't seem to have anymore. Where'd she go? Oh my gosh. I knew they roamed about, but I didn't think they basically ran away. <laughs> we, I got to look for her now. Well, we can go get the cow if we want to now. It should let me, unless the goose is dead. But I didn't see anything attacking nothing. 
I don't even hear her. Oh, what's this here? Is this a path all the way out of here? No, it goes to the... It goes to here. That's cool, huh? That's really cool. I like that. I'm going to leave that lid in right there, too. I like that. Look at that. Okay, so she's not down there. Hi. Maybe she's out here? I don't even hear a goose, though. There she is. What are you doing? Hey, you. Get over here. What do you think you're doing? Yeah. You're not wild anymore. You don't get to just go out here anymore. How did you get out? Because <laughs> that means other things can get out. Get in. Yeah, you're so smart. Get over here. Lousy goose. Smarter than the humans. Now you stay put. Oh, ye yes. Dang it. <laughs> She's out here on the beach with the cow. <laughs> it's pretty funny. I like that. All right. That's, that's one hell of a goose right there. Okay, where'd our cow go? Well, let's close the map. Oh, Missy Brown, Missy. Oh, Bessie, where are you? Oh, there's a chicken. Oh, it ran away. Oh, the cow's out in the water. I don't want the cow in the water. I'd like it down here a little ways. We'll come back. Let's uh, let's grab number three. Let's go do a little hunting. Hey, Chicky Poo. I'll come back and get you later. You're cute. I like him too. He's handsome. Where are the foxes and the stuff? No, don't. Oh, there it is. Yeah, take it, swine. Feel it. Feel the rage. Ugh. Get speared. We want to hustle you back. No, go the other way. No, well, whatever. Okay. We'll leave that one alone. Come on. Oh, goblins. Nice. Get him in the back. Yeah, he won't even know it's coming. Ooh. Ah. Get it, get it, get it. There you go. We need those hides. We need those, those things. We need that stuff. Get him. Get him while his back's turned. Oh, that's it. Get it. Kill that pig. Kill it. All right, let's take a seven. Let's take an eight. Let's hit control. Pick all that good stuff up. Mm, deliciousness. All the goods, they're ours now. We don't need to pick crops because we get tons of crops. Oh, my God. Look at this apple orchard over here, too. Oh, hey, Bessie. What you doing, sweetheart? Oh, get it. That's that's clothing. That's that's some that's some of our armor coming up here. Nice. There we go. Let's eat another uh, potato. Just keep working on that health as we are, as we lose it, we'll regain it. I heard another boar. It's a chicken. Watch out, Bessie. There it is. Get him. Oh, two of them. Uh oh, this is gonna be bad. Nah, we'll be okay. Potato. I hear goblins. Yeah, I hear him. Oh, there he is. Get him. Kill him. Ooh, what'd you drop? What'd you drop there, buddy? What was that? What'd he drop? Fox. Let's get it. Go get it. Go get it. Get it. Attack. Do what you're told. Soldier. Oh. No. Oh. Get it. Don't stop chasing it. Run it down. We need that hide. Kill these guys. All of them. Slaughter them. Now. Take like a seven. And an eight. I got you, buddy. Come here. Come here, you little green goblin. Oh, that's right. Take it to the face, punk. <laughs> I kind of like the fact that I can just sit back and relax while he's doing all the fighting. Oh. Oh, there you go. I see you. Yeah, stick him through the fence. Oh, I hit him twice before he even got to me once. Love it. Makes me happy. Oh, Fox, get this instead. Those guys don't seem to be dropping too much. 
Oh, quest completed. Explore the area. What's the light over there? Oh, what? No, kill this guy. Don't, don't look at the screen. Don't read. Yeah, you better run, punk. I got a sharp stick in my hand. I'll kill you with it. Well, there's a lot of them out here. Oh, you got huh? Take you down. Take you downtown to Chinatown, pal. Get him. Kill him. Kill him. There you go. Do it. Oh, yes. Nice. Oh, the slaughter is real. We've picked up some hides. What do we got in our inventory now? Uh, seven hides. It doesn't seem great, does it? Yeah, right. Oh, there you are. I see it. Bring her around the bush. Let's do it. Come on. Come on. Can you catch me? Oh. Oh, I turned on him. That was smart. That was smart. It was a smart move. Smart move there, radio. Way to, way to spin on him. Okay, so there's a light source over here that we have to explore and get to. Okay, so I think I think that's enough for one day, though, out here. At the moment. We can come back and do that and get over there. But it's going to be getting dark soon, and I wouldn't mind being home to... Uh, or, oh, get up! Get up! No! There you go! Get it! Yep! Yeah, mm-hmm! Kill the fox! Ah, here you go. Don't let him get away. Don't let him get away. You need those guts. Oh, there's an apple. Oh, here, let's hold on. Let's grab this bush. Let's eat another potato as well. It's gonna give us, I think it's 20 health. There we go, and some sticks. And I will take those apples, please. Let's go ahead and grab these here too. I'm gonna grab some sticks and head back home. It was a nice little run out. We should be able to finish our suit of armor and get that taken care of. But I want to make sure I have some sticks uh, so I can get the rope made tonight and then, you know, get our animals fenced in so they don't keep going to the beach. Jeez. I gotta work so hard to just take off for the beach. <laughs> it's like, hey. Two more leather. Two craft. And I think we've got that taken care of. I might make both sets of armor. Why the heck not, you know? He's working on it. Okay, so let's grab that. Inventory. Put that on right there. I might as well put these guys on the other slot, huh? There's our goose walking right next to us. <laughs> I can already see she's going to be some trouble for us, man. She's going to be some trouble. You got to love her, though. She's pretty sweet looking. Let's see here. And the shoes. We'll put that on number two, and we'll put our new stuff on number one. Because it's just fun to be on number one. Okay. Oh, I need some buttons, too. Uh, buttons, uh... There we go. Let's do six of those. Oops. I forgot about the buttons. You know, the grind is there, and you've got this this whole construction time you're doing and stuff. I, I kind of enjoy... I've got to say, I kind of enjoy watching him just work while I sit here and watch him work. <laughs> it's like, I'm done for the day, so why don't you do all the work? And he does. He does a fine, fine, fine job. We're almost done over here, too. And... Oh, that's one. We need the second one. And then we'll be able to make our skin. Yeah. Oh, we need buttons, too. Uh, let's go ahead and do... There we go. Another round of those guys as well. Awesome. That was it, right? That's all I needed? Yeah, there we go. And craft. All right. Full set of armor. Beautiful. Boom. Look at that. Look at our health. Look at our health going up. I take that off. 74. Now it's 79. Oh, 69. Yeah, that's, yeah see, that's, that's, just, that's just smart. We got extra armor now. That's what you do. You gotta level up right, baby. Um, oh, give me those bracers. That's a piece of armor we didn't have at all, so that's extra right there, too. We're up to 81 health points. It's pretty nice. Stamina's low, though. I can see where my stamina's gonna have to come up. I'm gonna have to work on that next. Now that we've got ourselves a base for kind of taking a punch here and there so I get used to the whole fighting thing, this will be good. This is good. Um, okay, I'm gonna put things away, and then I'll come back. we got a couple more claws. We need 12 for the, uh, the, the um, amulet. And then, you know what, I can act, yeah, okay. Uh, let's go back to move. Let's spin you around. Put you here. Yeah, go ahead and do that. And then we'll just run this over this way. 
Although I'm thinking those trees probably aren't enough to stop her right now, is it? Let's just keep going. If we can make more, we'll make more. Oh, uh, we can't. We are... Yeah, yeah, we can. Build mode. What happened? Oh, I'm too far down. Hello. <laughs> Hello, are you? Come over to say hi. Oh, here we go. Right here. What? What? No. Why is that? Why am I got three a, a three space here? Did I skip somewhere? I must have skipped somewhere. Dang it! I did not know. But it's gonna push everything down one more block this way, and then all the way over to here, and then that's not gonna line up over there. So I'm not quite sure where I went wrong here. Inside and inside. It's on the inside, and this is on the inside as well. So yeah, is is it the is it the gates that make it different? The gate is five. Oh, well. Then we need a three. A two and a one. Or some way to overlap these guys. Maybe there's a structure. Oh, I wonder if I could put the... I was just thinking maybe I could put the goosery backside to this, and then it would block that. Um, what do you think about what I'm going to do? Just take it easy, little lady. No, no, don't. Don't go through the only gap of the fence. Don't. Don't do that. Go on now. Go on. Follow me, Bessie. I like the capturing animals. Isn't that difficult? I'm a little confused as to why it takes two traps every time. I'm not quite sure about that one, but it always seems to take two. You, like, hit them for the first one, and then if you chase after them and throw it again, you've got quite a reach. Come on in here, Bessie. There you go. Welcome home to your crooked fence house. Wait here. We now have a cow and a goose. <laughs> Look at this. A cow and a goose. I'm going to have to wait for the sun to come up one more day so we can go over and see if we can explore that uh, that light. Uh, we should probably see about... We, well, we just accomplished some things here. We got skills here. To, oh, I probably had this forever, huh? A block. Sprint. Critical damage. How many points do I have? I've got three points, huh? Well, construction, I would love to go up. Uh, I'm at the bow and arrow level right now, so this is going to... Can I do this again? My stamina? It looks like I can, huh? Okay, let's do that. That's going to give us a boost right there. We'll do that. Uh, accuracy would be a good thing, because we're going to start using the bow, because we've got feathers now with the goose here. Block. Sprint. Hmm. Your running speed. I'm going to go with critical damage. Critical damage. Now, I'm not sure how to get that down into... I'm supposed to put it down here. The skill. Oh, do I go through... Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to get to that skill to do it. Here I go to my skill tree. Do I drag... Oh, I do. I drag it down here. Okay, so I do... Right there. Oh, I see. Okay. So if I hit R on something, I should get a critical strike on it. That's good. That's good. Okay, beautiful. Uh, God, I'm really concerned about this fence. I don't like that. But I do like the fact that they're now in here where they belong. <laughs> they're not, you know, roaming around and stuff. What's next on our agenda here? Check, oh, check the source of the strange light. Okay. I know if we go down there and we take care of that, we will eventually, we will get to copper, basically. And then we can get some copper stuff going on. Um, I was working on rope. Okay, let me get back to this, and then I shall come back. I think I'm going to wait one more day, and then we'll head out and go check out that, uh, the light. It has occurred to me that if I put a gate on the back fence, 
all this will have to move down as one square and then I would be even Steven along because I've got a gate here and a gate here and that's what makes these two sides different and I got a gate over here but I don't have one on the back wall so if I put one back there it'll clear it all out and we need one back there anyways let's go back here and take a look and see yeah we need one back here because there's more land back here that we can you know get ourselves involved in back here you know give the animals some room to uh oh go around oh by the way oh, feathers and some milk yeah we got a road here so let's just keep following it yeah, I, I can see now that you know this is the fence line here you can see it on the map oh we got it we got it okay let's let's drink one of our juices Oh, this is a big fight. Kill them all. That's okay, we got you. We got you. Get this guy. Let's drink another juice. Oh, he got me in the back. Not good. You're all dead. Oh, there's more of them back here. There can't be that many more here, right? We've killed like 10. That could be a slight exaggeration. Wow, there's a lot of goblins right there. There's another one right there. Oh, here's another one. Did I miss the turn? Let's grab some sticks too. Let's do it. Let's eat a potato. Get our health back up to about, what, 72 I think is what it is. Grab a couple of sticks here. Our wheat looks like it's... Our wheat's come in, folks. The wheat has come in. Oh, God. What is that? It's a wolf. Get it. It's causing eight damage to me. Oh, there we go. Nice. Level four. Can I do this? Max health. There we go. Oh, I don't know what I want to spend the other two points on. I'm going to hold off. Oh, I should be using my critical strike, too. Oh, I just used it. So it's like you gotta get through this gamut of guys to get to where you're going. Oh, here we go. There's a lot of enemies back in here. Okay, I'm, that's, that's good. That's good. Yeah, give me your pelt. Mess with the wrong dude. I'm gonna make all my armor. Okay, we got attack speed, critical strike. There's critical strike on the fox. Oh yeah, there we go. Yeah. Pig time. Take it, swine. Got your guts. Got your guts in my hide pocket right now. I do. I'm going to eat another potato before I move forward here. I think we can, cut. can we cut through here? I think we could. Oh, I could take this road up here too. Potato number two. Okay, that's going to get my, my, my food coming up. Oh, I see you. There's a lot of them up here, man. It's like goblins everywhere. Fortunately, they're not very tough. Oh, pig. Swine. Critical strike. There you go. Get rid of that pig right away. Bam. Take it. Take it, you little green freak. Gotcha. 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 We're almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, we got a bunch of dudes over here. I 
heard a wolf. Let's get our some of our health back. Oh, there's the wolf. It's coming. It's gonna happen. This fight's happening. Critical strike. Nine pelts, ladies and gentlemen. Nine pelts. Food. Eight. Got a seven. Oh, not yet. Got a seven. There we go. Slowly but surely, they seem to be bumping into us as we go through here. I'm going to go this way. Critical strike. Come on, get him. There you go, kill him. Food. We'll get that wolf first. Yeah, get that wolf. That wolf's bad news. Don't run it. Don't go after that guy who's running away. Don't chase that guy. A little bit of health back. Hold on. We're almost there. Let's go finish this guy off over here. Point. Another potato. Whew. He appears to be confused. That one back there. You can kind of avoid some of them, huh? A little bit, maybe. Critical strike. Hope there's a blue one here now. What's this blue guy all about? Oh, there's another blue guy here. Ooh, that's a bunch of dudes there. There's a lot of guys here. Those blue guys are a little bit harder. Woo, 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 woo. Lots of dudes, lots of dudes. Another potato. Critical strike. I want the blue one. Food. Whew. The bow and arrow might be better. There's a lot of these guys here. I'm a little surprised at just how many there are. Awesome. Oh, I wasted that critical strike on him. Nice, get them all. Yes, yes, get them all.
The critical strike makes it so there's one last hit I gotta do on that wolf. Each time, it seems like. We made it through that obstacle. Oh, oh my god, what the hell is that? That's a bear. I took stamina and food. the food man yeah I really hope they don't all respawn on me back here this is crazy there's a ton of dudes in here strike a few of them out better attack damage speed it up with the old uh, the old juice box nice I'm taking like baby steps and fighting a few at a time, you know what I mean, Jelly Bean? You gotta get, you gotta, you gotta take it easy. Critical strike, nice, 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 nice. Three hits. If you include a critical strike on him, we're gonna have that amulet now. I know it's dark, guys, but I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get there. This is, this is, oh, I made it. I made it. Oh, 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 look at this. We made it. Oh, such warriors. Look, we stand next to the ghost. Why'd you go away? <laughs> Dude. Oh, my gosh. Awesome. Hold on. Let's take a look at this place. We've got portals. I hear goblins. We have a ghost. Shift button. Magic blueberry. Ooh, really? Okay, let's talk to this guy. There we go. It's rare to meet a traveler here nowadays. Who are you? I've been wandering here for years. All this time I keep trying to recall who I am and why I am here. Do you know what this place is? It's an island of the ancients. They built these gates and an altar at the center several millennia ago. Legends say that they traveled to other worlds from this place. In my response, it seems to me that I'm not from this world too. Is the altar still working? Yes, it can still do a lot, but it needs the stone. What stone? The ancients could open the gates with the help of the stone, which is called the force of nature. The issue is that it has been broken apart years ago, and its shards have been scattered all over the world. The stone can be reassembled if you find all the pieces and put them together. Oh, is that so? What do we got here? Let's go uh, shift again. What do we got here? We got the magic blueberry. Uh, yes. And then space bar again. Magic blueberry, magic blueberry, magic blueberries. I'm assuming I want all of those for sure. And then did I grab that shard that was on the ground too? Inventory. Magic blueberry seeds, five of them. Ooh, and magic blueberries here. I saw that in a recipe. I was wondering where we were going to get those. That makes sense, though. Okay, got it. Uh, how are we doing so far in our trip? I'm waiting, kind of killing time here, hoping that the sun will come up and we can make our way back in the daylight. So that would be a little more fun for us to do that. Um, I got all that stuff here. What is this here now? What is, what is new here? Oh, what's this here? Oh, what's this? Oh, Force of Nature shard in my pouch? Do I leave it in my pouch? I do. Okay. Skills. Okay, what do we want to do for our skills here, ladies and gentlemen? I think we should probably put one in construction. We've not done that yet. Sprint. Attack. Your attack... Increases your attack speed. Uh, my, I seem to move just fine. I'm going to go with the Berserk and, and speed up the, the speed. I see you found one of the shards of the Forest of Nature. You need to put it into the altar. With each added shard, the altar will regain some of the lost power. Uh-huh. Gotcha. Okay. Force of Nature shard. In you go. 
<gasps> oh my god. The portal. The portal. Where will it take us? Let's go. What do I do? Do not know how to use this gate. Yes, I don't. How do <laughs> Hey, excuse me, ghost. Uh, you don't happen to have the instructions, do you? <laughs> you cannot pass through the gates without magic skills. Oh, I can teach you these skills and also help you with several tasks surrounding your base. Oh, it certainly beats hundreds of years of loneliness. Oh, surely. You can call upon me wherever you are and I can bring you back to where you first appeared in this world. Perfect. Teleport me. Got it. Thank you. I'm going to take a look around here. Oh, let's, um... Oh... So I can conjure him whenever I want to, right? From here. Repair, build, craft, mine, talk. In order to pass through the gates, you'll have to master your skills and you'll be able to build a portal. Okay, I'll try. Oh, you know what? Oh, get me out of here. I see that's where that is, huh? Okay. What's this all about? Ask the wanderer to teleport you. Oh. Oh, that's a, that's a thing, huh? So I need to do that. Okay, so I guess I could look around some more, but... Oh, you know what? I think I click down here. Uh-oh, oh, talk. Uh-huh, get me out of here. Well, hold on. Let me kill this. There you go. Now can you get me out of here? <laughs> How do I do it fast? Get me out of here. I must have been fighting, so he couldn't do it. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello there. A great adventure that was. Oh my god, I enjoyed that 100%. I did. I did. I enjoyed that 100%. Let's see what we got here. 14 pelts, people. Look at that. That's pretty sweet. Oh, we got these seeds, too. Oh, let's put some stuff away. Take a look. Oh, we got new stuff on the benches. Ay, 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 ay. There's going to be so many new things, it's going to be unbelievable. Uh, let's see. Ectoplasm. Aha, there it is. That's what I saw. Milk, magic blueberries, and ash. That's so we get to the smeltery. We need to go back through there and go through that gate. We need to put a teleporter here and put one over there so we can get through it. I think that's probably what our next task is going to have to be. Uh, let's throw you in there. And do I have some sticks laying around here? I thought I had put sticks in a basket. There they are. Bump and a bump. We have a few more meat. Uh, should I keep the meat? I feel like carrying the baked potatoes is a good idea because they drop baked potatoes. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? And I, maybe I should just eat this around home, or maybe I should just hold on to it somewhere. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Tons of questions, right? Oh, we gotta plant those seeds though. Um, where's the water at? Can I use this water? Does it have to be pure water? Pure water. Let's see. New, new, coming now. Coming to a planter bed near you. Magic blueberry. Ah ha ha, look at this. It's gotta use pure water, you son of a gun. I knew it. I knew it. You're gonna make me get pure water. That's why I started some. No fool. I don't know what's gonna happen. I think you got me, did you, game, huh? I got nine over here, and I got another 20 over here. Oh, oops. thank you. Sorry. Sorry, game. Let's go plant those guys. A bunch of blueberries. Uh, we'll put you guys right, right here in the middle. Right here in the middle. Magic blueberries. Okay, magic blueberries. Plant. Oh, lovely. Wheat. Now, does it use the wrong water for this? Oh, I don't want to use that water anyways. Uh, yeah, let's... um. Let's swap this out. There we go. Thank goodness. Plant. 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 And plant. There we go. Oh. Goose is a honking. I heard it. Alright, we're getting that built up. That was really fun, you guys. Oh my god, that was really fun. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed going out there and kicking some butt. Just having a good time and kind of getting a feel for how the enemies are. Oh, look at that. We've got plenty of wheat. Now we need storage over by the uh, bins. I'll, I'll get the fence put in, the gate, 
so that the whole thing lines up better. My mistake, my bad, as usual. It always is. Hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share on the Radio Man 03. Have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day, and I look forward to talking to you again next time. Critical Strike. Mm, it works. <laughs>